Hey everyone, Stephanie here. This is a video I've been wanting to do for a while and I'm finally getting around to it. So every week I have to refill my vitamin tray and I wanted to share with you the process of how I do it and also share with you um, some of the supplements that I take on a regular basis. Many of you who work with me, I have you taking supplements and you probably think you're taking a lot. Well, you're probably not taking as many as me. Uh, not that I have anything really going on with my health, but I'm a very proactive person, so I wanna make sure that my health stays really well. I'm slowly approaching 50, so I wanna make sure that as I go through menopause that I am not very symptomatic, so I'm doing a lot of things in a prevention type of way. So I wanted to share with you a little bit about what I take. So every week when my vitamin box becomes empty, okay, then I have to refill it. So I only have to do this process once a week, which is really awesome. So the majority of things that I take are obviously from Standard Process and MediHerb, if you know anything about my company, but I take a few other products as well. I'm not going to actually fill the box, but I'm going to tell you most of the things that I am taking right now. So let's start with a product that has just come back into my life recently. I was using this product years ago. It is called Restore. I don't know if you can see it, but this is a liquid product. It does not have to be refrigerated. This is really good for the gut integrity, intestinal permeability, leaky gut. It's good for your immune system. It's really amazing. Um, there's been tons of research done on it and uh, it's actually really popular. So I st just started integrating it again into my supplement routine and also recommending it to many patients. So I take that a few times a day, um, a couple teaspoons. This is really easy to take. Uh, then to keep out heavy metals and detoxify in general, I take a zeolite product. So zeolite is a type of thing that just removes toxins and heavy metals from the body. So this is a spray form. This is from Results RNA, and this is called ACZ Nano. And I spray this on my tongue a couple times a day. Really easy to use. Okay, next, this is from a company called Professional Health Products. This is called Ecothyro 37. This is a thyroid concentrate. So I don't really have a thyroid problem, but on my hair test, it showed that my thyroid wasn't optimal, so I started taking this. I only take one per day, and it has made a really dramatic difference in how I feel overall. Okay, so now let's get to the rest. Okay, so let's start with something that I've been taking from MediHerb for a really long time. This is called Chaste Tree. Hopefully you can see that. Chaste Tree. This is an herb that is really amazing for all female issues. So whether it's PMS, endometriosis, difficulty with periods, perimenopause, menopause, all kinds of female issues. This is Chase Tree or Vitex. That's another uh, word, Vitex Agnes. I take this every day and I've been taking this for a really long time. Just take two per day. Okay, so I just had gum surgery last week. So I'm taking a couple different products now because of that to help speed up the healing. One of my favorites for that is Chlorophyll Complex. This is different than the regular chlorophyll products on the market. This is a fat soluble chlorophyll, not water soluble. So it has um, more ingredients and more things for, that promote healing. So I take a couple of these on an empty stomach a few times per day. In general, I like to take it, but especially now that my gums are healing. And in addition to that, I just started taking Go to Cola Complex from MediHerb. So this is an herbal product that is really awesome for healing as well. It contains Go to Cola leaf, grapeseed, and ginkgo. So this is really amazing. It's good for lots of different things, but especially for healing from surgeries. Okay, so next, to help with my female issues. Also, I take OVXP. This is from Standard Process. This is just to help support my ovaries, to make my cycles less difficult, uh, et cetera, et cetera. So I take that every day. One of my all-time favorites, this is from MediHerb. This is Ashwagandha Complex. I take this to support my adrenals. This contains skullcap, licorice, ashwagandha, and Korean ginseng. 
So this is good for any type of adrenal issue. It's good for sleep issues, it's good for stress. It just helps me stay you know, in a good mood, calm, focused most of the time, helps me sleep right. And going, getting closer to menopause, I know it's really important to support my adrenal glands, so I make sure that I'm taking care of them with herbal support. And then the uh, vitamin support to go along with it is something called Drenamin. And most people in my practice will recognize Drenamin. Um, since most people have some kind of adrenal issue, I have a lot of people on Drenamin. Drenamin is basically a multivitamin for the adrenals. It contains B complex, vitamin C, and also some adrenal direct in there. Okay, that's one of my all time favorites. And then in addition to that for the adrenals is Cataplex B. This is a B complex, but it's a different B complex than what is in Drenamin. This contains every part of the B complex that there is. This is also good for a number of other issues, for energy, for methylation, for heart health, all kinds of things. All right, so on the essential fatty acid sides, I take standard process cod liver oil. This is an amazing source of not only DHA and EPA, omega-3s, but also vitamin D, vitamin A, vitamin F, a lot of the fat soluble vitamins are in this cod liver oil and it's very clean and pristine. Okay, let's see what else am I currently taking. Uh, okay, so to support my thyroid in addition to what I mentioned, I take iodine. This is not the standard process iodine, but I do like this Litka iodine. It's a higher dose than the standard process line. Um, which I find works really well for me. I only have to take one of these per day. Iodine is really important for the thyroid. This formula right here, Trace Minerals B12 from Standard Process, this has some iodine in it, but the main thing about this, it has all of the trace minerals in here. Our diets are very poor in trace minerals overall um, because the soil is depleted. So this has all the trace minerals that we're missing in our diet, plus a little bit of B12. Okay, so that's a standard uh, in one of the products that I give to people. All right, this is one of my all-time favorites. I will probably always take this because this is something that I feel the difference whether I'm taking it or not. This is rhodiola and ginseng complex from Mediherb. It's basically just those two herbs, rhodiola and ginseng. Um, rhodiola is a, an herb that the Russians use quite a bit in the Olympics. It's really good for stamina, vitality. Ginseng is good for a gazillion things. I could do a whole video on ginseng, but I really love how I feel taking this so that I make that a part of my everyday thing. Okay, another one of my favorites. I have so many. This is also from Medi Herb. I did a video on this not that long ago. This is called Turmeric Forte. This is an amazing bioavailable form of turmeric, which I'm sure you've heard of. It's really popular nowadays, curcumin, okay? It's good for so many things. Inflammation, diabetes, Alzheimer prevention, pain, you name it. It's an, ama an amazing herb. I only take two of these per day. Very easy to get in. So lately I haven't really been eating as many vegetables as I want. I've just, since it's summertime, I've just been eating salads. So I've been skimping on my other vegetables like cruciferous and stuff like that. So I added back in a standard process green food to give me some of the vegetables that I'm currently not taking or, or eating, I should say. The cruciferous vegetables, Brussels sprouts, buck, well, buckwheat is not cruciferous, but kale. So some of the things that I haven't been eating lately, I figured I'm gonna put it into my supplement form because eating those kind of vegetables is really amazing and important for your liver for detoxification to help clear out the bad estrogens in the body, especially important for females. So I wanted to make sure I added that back into the mix. Beta food, this is another really awesome product. One of the biggest sellers. This is basically just beets, okay? So beets are really important for the liver and gallbladder. Helps with fat digestion, helps with methylation. Lots of benefits to taking this. So um, I don't always take beta food, but I take it every couple of months for like a bottle or two, just to make sure that I'm taking care of my gallbladder and liver in an effective way. Cataplex F, that's the last one I think I'm gonna bring up for today. Cataplex F is basically vitamin F, which you probably have never heard of. So this is basically essential fatty acids in a different form similar to flax, okay? So this is good for a variety of things. 
Obviously, it's a healthy fat. It's good for the thyroid. It's good for the prostate. And believe it or not, this is really also good for preventing sunburn because sunburn comes from a variety of different, well, it comes from the sun, obviously. But the reason people burn easier is because they're missing certain nutrients and things aren't going where they need to go within the body. D, calcium, it's, it's kind of a complicated equation and I'll do that in another video. But in any case, Cataplex F is a great source of essential fatty acids. It's called vitamin F. And that's another thing that I have been taking, especially in the summertime. I will really load up on this before I go out and lay in the sun. Uh, so two other things that I'm taking that are not here because they're in a powdered form. I add them to my smoothies. I take standard process calcium lactate and their easy mag magnesium. I add those to my smoothies, okay? Um, they're amazing just, you know, on their own. So basically that's it. I, now, like I said, I, I rotate. Sometimes I take other products, but basically right now I'm taking basic support. I'm taking things for my hormones, for my adrenals, for the surgery that I'm healing from. But I rotate through supplements. I don't always take the same things all the time. Sometimes I take less, sometimes I take more. But I just wanted to share with you a little bit about what I've been taking and show you this amazing vitamin box. And what's great about this too is you could take out one of the sleeves and take it with you to work or wherever you need to go so you don't have to worry about traveling with it. So thank you guys, hope this was helpful and uh, when you go to take your vitamins, you know that I'm probably taking more than you are, so hang in there. All right, thanks for watching and I'll see you next time and um, let me know in the comments below if you're taking any of these products yourself and what you think of them, okay? Thanks and I will see you soon, bye.